hidden Machina village? A village in a place like this? Malia! Shulk! Guys! Wait, what? What? You were right! What happened to the... Oh, yeah! <laughs> And we found Fiora. Dunban. Fiora? Do you remember me? Mm hmm. Sorry if I made you worry. It's all right. I'm just so glad you're alive. Oh, dear brother. Shulk, is that your childhood friend? Yeah. Congratulations. I'm glad she is safe. Thank you. I couldn't have done it without you. But how did you all get here? Gravity. And what is this place anyway? <gasps> These people helped us. Huh? This is their home. Your surprise is understandable. We are the Machina. The people of Mekonis. What? Machina? You mean machine people? You look as if you have many questions. But please, take a look around our village first. We will talk after that. I will be waiting in front of the building we call Junks. I have several questions in the fact. Not only about logistics, but like a couple other things. And now the party's got to be changed. Fuck. I, uh, Shulk is required because he's the main character. Fiora, I almost say is required because she's the childhood friend and Mechon. And Mechon. But. <laughs> Ricky is the main hero pun. He is the main character. I will, I will yield that front. Ricky is the protagonist of the story. The only reason we are not following his story is because Shulk is the one that stole them the plot sword first. But now Melia, I... Would this team work out? And I make it work out. Would Ricky be able to pull double time as the healer? Because apparently Fiora can only regen for herself. I have a single random off heal that I can use on someone, but it's on a such a long, a long cooldown that it feels rough and like not great. Can Ricky pull double time as the healer? Oh shit, new person. I'm gonna say her name wrong. Hold on. I'm gonna say your name horribly wrong. Hold on, I'm gonna sound it on my head. Um. Dyron cracked? Oh, what's wrong with? How's it going? Welcome to the stream. As I was just saying, it's almost Waifu Wars li live right now. <laughs> Ricky is so cute. Ricky is the life of the party. While everyone looks all stoic, everyone's got their like little things. No, Ricky has character. He is lovable. He is tiny. He's exaggerated. He has the most HP in the game. Because a single dev said, give him the most HP and no one corrected it. He is the hero the world needs. The one we deserve and the one we desperately need. But now I am.
Have a question? What up, Angelo? She's the one that's gotten the most um, uh, build out. Actually, no, Ricky's the one that got the most build um, uh, stuff put into. Aside that, her. But now that Fiora's back. Hmm. With the entire team. Isn't the average age of our party the same as Yakuza 8? Wait, 8? I thought there was only 7. Like, 6 for Kiryu. And 7 is, um, uh, what's it called? Ichiban. And not everyone in the party is that old, right? Not a sequel, forget it. Wait, wait, hold on, what? There's a, there's a sequel? Hold on, you have my attention now. What do you mean there's a sequel for... Oh, they already announced it. How are you liking the amazing game, Rebellion? I... I'm gonna be honest. The game is, like, sort of, like, losing me at the same time gripping me with the story. The story, I want to say, is the biggest selling point of this game. The characters, I feel, could be hit or miss. And the combat, it is definitely not my flavor. I just like how it's MMO style. I just like the intensely long cooldown for their skills. And I love the world. The scale of it all. Like, the knowledge that you are on top of literally two ancient beings that fought for who knows how long and then when they stopped and life grew on them and you could tell that it's just limbs of their body that we're just crawling all over i love that so much the combat itself though if i could change that i would love this game i feel and it sounds awful because it's like i love the i love what the game was trying to do but the gameplay itself is awful. And I don't want to come off as that. I just am not a fan of the MMO style. If you're near them, you'll attack. If not, you're looking stupid. Use a skull on cooldown and then wait a minute to do it, to do it again. It's definitely not my flavor. Hold on. I definitely got to find more books. So everyone can start actually getting like proper skill development. Cause God, I feel awful. But aside from that, for these characters, I have several questions about how the story is going to try and explain it. That a Xenoblade Warriors game would be humorously good. I feel like if it's a Xenoblade Warriors game, such as Dynasty Warriors, Strikers, like for Persona and all that, where it's just fight, I feel like it'd be awesome. But another part of me wants to say that it would be uh, Xenoblade Wars in the sense of all special combos are locked to menuing and then waiting for it to happen again. We just got here, so please don't mention. I just, I, I like to sort of inquire into the void and just sort of think on my own. Chad can vouch for how observant I can be at times and how shit my memory is. I can guess a game's story rather reliably and then forget I've guessed it until something brings up and then that whole memory comes flooding back. But this story is very much, I feel, within the realms of being guessable. It's only because I know it's like mirroring a lot of Zeno Gears. Yeah, that's the thing. It's not hard after Zeno Gears, so I don't want to go too far in. What do you need? All these weapons are solid-ish, but probably not going to be used entirely because they don't have enough slots. That two slot is hard to uh, pass up on. All right, want to put a game up to vote? Use your points, man. Burn a knight. 
double blade for you. Headshot. I'll get double blade for you. Why not? Ricky's angry is his ammo, one that reflects damage. Air drain, summon earth. You're around. I don't know about other drain. Ricky's angry, I'll grab like one of that, sure. I'm just not sure how good other drain would scale up to be. Hold on. Is this one is I can get that down to a reasonable cooldown for just uh, Strangers of Paradise, Final Fantasy Origin. Alright. That'll be added on to the next time I vote we do for what game we play. Wait, is that the Hey, is that the one that's just all the killing chaos thing? All right, I've seen the memes of it, but I've not seen anyone play it, so that would be a blind playthrough. All right, I'm all for it. I show for that out. You should. Everyone should show up for the votes. Down to seventy-six. That at least is not as bad. Finally, a good Final Fantasy. Hey, Tactics is good, Angela. What are you talking about? The OG Final Fantasy Tactics is pretty damn fucking good. Heard Limbus. I don't know what that is. I never know when a vote is otherwise I would show. I pinged the Discord server using the here, mata, here one to say, yo, you voted on for a game. Vote whichever ones you want, man. That's because you probably have the channel muted, in which case I actually still wouldn't blame you. I'm just good at the band. Never heard of them. Yeah, generally the game vote stays there for a week on the game vote tab on the Discord server. If you show up, if you look at that once a week, you probably will see it. That's how it's spelled. I still don't know what it is. If it's a band, I've never heard of them. Oh, she finally has... Oh, no. She finally got another one. Yeah, that's it. Well, for you... I want to get this one. Then we can start working on a circle, which is increased damage of critical hits. All right. So now... Actually, Hi there. what do you have for trade? Would you like to trade? Uh, did you say? Buff time plus, which we don't know how good it is. And Abysma either. I think I have five of those already, but I don't have any buff times plus some yes for that. Welcome. His legs, no. I have I wanna say five of those as well, so I don't really care for that. Shops or anything else to look at here. So, game. Regaled me with the story of why there are machine people here. How are you? Go back. Have you finished your looking around the village? Then I'll answer your questions. Where should I start?
So, are you Mekon? In one sense we are, and in another we are not. It is a fact that the weapons you call the Mekon were created by our civilization. However, we were born from the Mekonis. By your understanding, it would be correct to say that we are the same as Mekon. A form of mechanical life born of the Mekonis. Is that correct? From our perspective, you are forms of organic life born of the Bionis. Life born of the Mekonis? So there is life here, just like on Bionis. Explain to us why you invaded our world. What did we ever do to you? I understand your feelings, but please, there is much yet to tell you. Dunban, please hear her out. But... These Machina, they're good people. Fiora? You do not look fully functional. Ever since she was given this body, she hasn't been feeling too good. But we honestly don't know what to do. Do you mean to tell me you are not Machina? Why didn't you tell me sooner? I'm okay. Really. Nonsense. I am a doctor. Do not worry. I specialize in people in your... situation. Just as I thought, you were transformed into a face unit. You are experiencing a functional breakdown in multiple locations. I will take her to my laboratory. The Chief will answer your questions. He is waiting for you in junks. For us? We will speak later. Shulk, I'm... Fiora. Don't worry. I'll keep an eye on her. Thanks. Well, there goes the party structure already. All right, Dunman, get out of here. No, Melly is back in. I'll answer your questions. Wait, not now. Huh? He's massive. <laughs> I get a kick out of seeing people's faces every time. <laughs> we were told that you were waiting for us. That's right. I've been waiting a long time. Waiting for you to accept my request. Request? But first, let me ask. The sword the young man is holding. Is that the Monado? It is. And the destruction of the fortress on the sword. Was that your lot's doing? Yes. Although, unfortunately, we were unable to stop Egil. Egil? Do you know him? He claims to be the leader of Maconis. This Egil that you fought is one of our people. He's my son. Your son? Actually... My request is about him as well. Ah. I want you to kill Egil. Dearest Homs and Nopon representatives, my humble gratitude for accepting our invitation. I am Kalyan Antiqua, regent of the High Entia. We all know who you are. You High Entia have kept yourselves safe, remaining spectators to our destruction. Why call upon us now? As stated in my invitation, it is our intention to form an allied force from the peoples of Bionis. 
with which we will confront Mekonis. <laughs> Look at you. One little scratch and you're already crying for help. I cannot deny this. The attack did serve as the catalyst, but the fact remains that things have changed. When we needed help at the Battle of Sword Valley, our cries were ignored. Give me one good reason why we should bother. Huh. I understand your anger. Our selfishness was inexcusable. However, please hear what I have to say. Listen to why our stance has changed. <laughs> Stop talking if you like, but no promises we'll stick around to the end. We High Entia were mistaken. We believed that if we were attacked by the Mekon, our power alone could repel them. But a brave group of young heroes showed us the error of our ways. When the Mekon descended upon Aerith Sea, Shulk fought with a courage I have never seen. I was most surprised to see that this group was comprised of different races. Homs, Nopon, High Entia. Although different, they trusted one another as friends. As just one inhabitant of Bionis, I desired to... No, I felt compelled to become strong like them. Mm. Their strength came from the Monado. Bravery only gets you so far in this world. Then you will not join us? Hold your horses, son. I said they didn't win with bravery alone, but they wouldn't have got far without it. All right, you can count on our help. The Nopon will join too. The Hum Hum and Bird people are friends of the Nopon. We will fight together. Dixon, are you leaving? Yeah. It's just I felt this sudden pain in the neck. Is that your response? Don't go jumping the gun there, Prince. I'll leave the colony's forces with old Atharon here. You can use them however you want. I've got somewhere I need to be. Might I ask where? A battle's more than just a head-on assault. The sooner you realize that, the better. I better go and remind Shulk and all. So you know of their whereabouts? I told you. I've got a pretty good idea. Dixon! Yeah? If you should meet Shulk... What? I have something I want you to tell him. You want us to kill your son? That is no small request. There are hardly any of us macking her left on Mekonis. Back when the Bionis and the Mechonis were fighting, the Bionis almost completely wiped us out. I suppose the Bionis just didn't want us around. Lady Maynath fought the Bionis for us. In the end, the two Titans wounded each other and entered a deep slumber. Who was Lady Maynath? The creator of Mechonis. You could say that she is the Mechonis itself. It's all like you saw all this. Ain't this all just an ancient myth? <laughs> I know I look young, but I'm actually quite old. I saw the whole thing with my own eyes. You can't be serious. The people of Makonis must have a longer lifespan. Just like we High Entia live far longer than Homs. I get that. But he can't have lived that long. But why do you want your son dead? From what you've told us, I would have thought you'd want us to destroy the Bionis rather than kill your own son. Agil was a brilliant young man. Clever, strong, and kind to the less able. But he never forgave the Bionis for what it did, and he swore to take revenge. So he wants to do to us what the Bionis did to the Machina? Correct. Agil is trying to eradicate all innocent life on Bionis. He has to be stopped. Didn't you ever try to stop him? We tried once. A lot of people were killed. He's blinded by revenge. Even Lady Maynath herself couldn't convince him to stop. Where is Egil now? Most likely the Mekonis capital. He's trying to restore its former glory all by himself. I... feel sorry for him. Oi! What are you talking about? Did you forget what he did to us? I haven't forgotten or forgiven. But Egil's clearly suffered a lot in his life. You don't feel any sympathy at all? 
All I know is, this stinks. Who cares what he's been through? Ryan. I understand about Egil. But why us? You should be aware that Shulk's sword, the Monado, has the power to destroy Mekonis' weaponry. It's said that it was once the sword of the Bionis. Doesn't the very sight of it make you quiver? Zanta. Huh? Oh, just talking to myself. If you're gonna kill Egil, you'll need all of that sword's power. That's how strong Egil is. But enough talk. You must be tired. Take your time and think it over. Until the young lady's treatment is finished, feel free to spend time in our village. <laughs> She has done well to survive such injury. What do you mean? Is she sick? Since you seem to have knowledge of Hom's medicine, I'll explain it like this. I'm afraid she's had several of her organs removed. Am I correct in assuming she was configured to operate inside a Mekon? That's right. She has been transformed into a Mekon's central nerve unit. Her blood can now circulate through a Mekon's components. How? I believe her immune system is now configured for compatibility with the Mekon. That's why her strength has depleted. But you can treat her, can't you? Please. Of course. Even as a Makana doctor, I cannot turn a blind eye to this butchery. With our equipment, she will regain her strength, but she will be stuck with this body. I cannot restore her flesh and blood, Hom's body. That's okay. I don't want to be a burden to Shulk. I don't care if I have a machine body. Just make it so I can fight beside him. Viora, leave it to me. If that is your wish, I'll do my best. I must implant a new circulation system for her immune functions. But we have one problem. A problem? I don't have a piezoelectric unit, which is required to control such a system. As long as she remains on this bed, the life support machine can compensate. But to move around freely, she must have the piezoelectric unit. The same unit is used in Mekon, so if you were to find some Mekon parts... But where? Well, outside of the village at the base of Digit 5, there's a beach. Debris from above washes the shore there. You might be able to find one among the Mekon wreckage. We'll take a look. The beach at the base of Digit 5, right? Yes. It gives off a faint red glow, so it might be easier to find at night. Which digit is number 5, though? Do they start counting from the thumb, or do they start counting from the pinky? What if there's more than... What if... Why do we think it only has five fingers? What if it has more than that? We have to find the one in the middle that's number five or something. Are you okay? All right. And yeah, that name is a bit of a head scratcher. I am concerned about you, though. This girl. I don't know! in the factory she's the one that insisted if we walked it near the green sewer she just said jump in and kept on getting herself down to one hp when we right before we'd fight something we'd be like trying to creep up around that she would just say jump into the in the sewer and then i just say hp go down to one we have to like run back so she teleports to us and heal up again ours just insists on like colliding with stuff and just this just being the jankiest thing so far in this run because I know I'm going to fight something here. Doesn't keep going. He deserves it. 
It knows what it did in the past life. It's unforgivable. It's over. Breaking luck fighting easy monsters. Let us hurry onward. That's a four. We can find fours now. All right. We got to check everything to try and find like good four uh, gems. All right, what is that bright ice crystal? As a defense up, another protect. Eyes won't increase much from four, but that means that there is an increase still. That means there is still an increase. We can't lose. You dare challenge him, Morgan? You'll be no mercy. Some little sprints winning. Thank you, Ricky Time. Good well be with me. Ricky Sneaker. Ricky Time is flowing through me. Even if I present on the side of battle, I know and I hate it. Quick step and good footing. Are we gonna I wonder how hard it's gonna be to find like HP up and such? These guys might not drop it. I'll fight one more and then I'm gonna see if I can find a different enemy and we will try to see what he dropped. Angelo, we are not winning fights much higher than ours. Not with any amount of consistency. That one didn't even give me a chest, but all right. Dangle that fish thing after how long? We can't lose. Freaking no like this. Display no mercy. Take this. Summon. Ah. 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 This will be the mark. Break away. Oh, great. That's going to alert the entire village and the entire continent that we're fighting right here. Ah. How can this be? I did that way too early. Oh wait, these are actually Mechon. Give them the buff. Red monsters? No, we were not killing red monsters at all. Or at least not intentionally. If they fell off the planet, then that was their fault. I mean, how did I? How did you not get out, dragged in? All right. No, I might just fight this one on my own right here because I want to save the store so we can have it immediately for the next fight. Come on. 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 Come on.
Come online, SD. Yep. And it's nighttime. It was already nighttime ish. But now it's extra nighttime. It might be a pretty good story for all I know. Let's see if you guys give anything good. These aren't mecha, I think, so. Silver, you drop. We'll never know. I want to see if we could find a health up one or an attack up one or something. Sleep. Everyone do good, but we cannot be reckless. Esports switch. you could try to even play, play harder into the suit MMO while speeding up combat considerably. Hmm. I don't know if I would play the game though. Like you guys have to probably vote it up for me to actually try and play it. So far, this game, for the start of the, I'm assuming, the whole Xenogears game series timeline, the story is strong, but I do feel parallels with some uh, Xenogears. Oh, well, I was saying Xenogears, so it's double blade shit, but, like, for Xenoblade, I don't know if I want to play the second one after playing this one. Like, it's got to end fantastic for me to want to still follow the series, because right now, it's... For where I am in the story and where I am in my enjoyment of the game, I want to say it's showing some cracks. While I value the story immensely in games I play, the gameplay's got to at least hold its hold up some part of that couch. When you play Ravi Second, can't be worse. Ravi Second wasn't bad though. I mean, this game ain't bad either, but still, like, Raven Second still had gameplay that was enjoyable. Muscle up. That's defense up and weapon power, I think, was increasing minimums, right? Health attack stealth actually is... I mean, how good could you make those even? Let me see.
This is my Ricky forte. Want to play? All right, we made it one to an eighty-four at the very least. So, boost aggro drawn from auto attacks and resistance against a blowdown. Yeah, you can try to make. We've done that a couple of times. We try to manufacture gems that are as close to ninety-nine as possible. Stack them both, soak and run, so they can reach hundred percent. So that way, you get double gems at max roll possibility. I don't know if that's going to actually become a thing, but I guess it's a high defense, so let's grab that. Auto attack stealth. We have one of them now. Auto attack stealth 59 here. We'll do the exact same thing here. This is my forte. Want to play? We make it. All right, 94. That's good. The chill attack we actually got, so... Let's save real fast. Back down one too many times on the menu. A 94 and an 84. To rank up yet? We've gotten it several times to rank up. All right, Ryan, you can do it. I'm it's within right range. Right Party support at all? Fuck, fine. What role was that? 27% of a reduction in auto attack aggro? Shining, don't let me, don't let my view on a game somehow alter your thoughts on a game and how much you should push it on others. I can still say there's a good game here. I will just say it is not a game that I would thoroughly enjoy. The story I would come for and I would like pursue actively. It's a good story, a good setting. The gameplay is what I personally struggle with. Don't let someone else dictate what you like and what you want to actually see other people enjoy. I'm just a bad choice for this one, unfortunately. That's the way it goes sometimes. Anything? This ain't bad at all. That was 26%. It might go to 30, I'm assuming then. Or 29, maybe. the combat because you can do some crazy in the chain attacks but i feel like that's not directly tied to combat chain attacks is not a requirement of this sort of combat style i feel like chain attacks could be achieved in other sorts of combat if you just implemented and had i say implement because that sounds easy in my head but still i did feel like this uh, combat style demands a chain attack system and even then does the combat not work then if you remove the chain attack system I feel like they could have done different I'm combat systems and a chain attack would still technically exist all in right. a way. Alrighty. Or it at least could probably show up and oh yes! There you go. Wow, this is absolutely mint. Alright, five. Crack. We get two of them now at max roll. What was the max roll? 30%. This is 60% of aggro reduction for someone who's attacking.
boost physical damage. Would that be something? Oh my god, I have so many to pick from. Xenoblade Chronicles 1 is considered to be setup heavy, so battles are more won before they even begun. With little skill execution. It's just about building. That one keeps a bit of the of that, but they're more mid combat strategy. to be used to make fights fast i can understand that i could see it and appreciate it but let's throw this binder this just in there ricky can you get physical protect up but not at 100 percent this is my favorite one to play hmm. Ooh. Ooh. impressive Ooh. yeah Hmm. I'm kind of sad that Binders is the one that got that big boost because I feel like that would have gotten us to a 90% here. be a tad tricky 270s will not be possible without maybe maybe some maximum rng rolls this is my forte one to play hmm. 88 is pretty good though Some mobs need to get chain attack to get toppled. And the multiplier does crazy damage against bosses and hordes. So if you can set up correctly, you can do crazy stuff. Eighty-eight and seventy-six. Possible. Just lightly rough in the RNG department to be able to try and get a five out of that. I'm all I got it. This is a good result. Now with like some fucking low rolls like that though. But all right, to confirm that can go to 40% physical damage reduction i'm assuming 40 percent if not 39 and 30 38 that's gonna kind of be rough but we can work with that i've seen resonance of fate and i say then that like when i used to go buy games physically at like and i would rent games from blockbuster and all that maybe not blockbuster but like, I remember seeing it on the shelf of, like, some of the game stores I would go to back in the day. I never knew what it was about. I always skipped it. Like, really innocent. There's not much going on right now. It's just an attempt at fusion. Crafting. We need I fever, and I we need that. party supports. And not other types of flame. Wow, this is and not like mint. single digit roll or like one rolls. God, game, come on. There's 40 though. <laughs> That's probably a high roll right there. Mm, I might try to make another one that's like in the high 80s so that we can be a bit more consistent. Because this 88 and 76, it's, it's good, but. Mm. 
Let's try and see if I can score another one that's like in the 80s again. Maybe. This is my we'll get lucky. Want to play? Maybe, but then again, it would just possibly all go to getting three on this thing. We got the nice number, but unfortunately... I feel like doing it with Ryan would be alright, just because... It might not roll on what we want, but still, we can try to keep it low. I'm all Thank over that. To play. I mean, they're all going to turn into him, sure. That didn't go fucking anywhere. Eighty-eight and seventy-six. That's. This is playing with fire right here. Because all it takes is the strong flame getting picks on physical protect. It will activate twice and then it's all out. I'm all over that. Want to play? 87's good. 87's good, actually. And with that, we have an 88 and 87. That's 175. That is actually a decent base. All right, Ryan time. Come on, let's go. I'm all I got it. Party support, fever, anything? Wow, this is absolutely mint. <laughs> it goes above Fort. Oh shit, what? How? It's got to cap out at 50 or something maybe, right? I'm pretty sure they're not going to let me put two of that and then like some person's going to get 90% physical damage reduction, right? They wouldn't let me go that far. Not initially, at least. I'm all I got it. That. Either party support any game. I need something, man. This is actually not that rough of RNG that we need. It's just I think we're rolling really low. I'm go then I'm gonna go back to killing the local wildlife. I'm all I got it. Hey, this ain't bad. That was this ain't bad only. at all. Have Ryan in the lead, he gives a lot more points, but unfortunately, Shulk is not that great of like trying to get only one. I'm having Shulk in the lead because I hope for fever, but apparently, I'm putting my hopes in nothing. <laughs> We're gonna do like two more times of this and then we're gonna maybe try with him first. But also these guys have like the highest affinity for me, so like they are the most consistent one I have. Like that. Thank god. This is better than usual. Okay, I was gonna say, because we've had it stop at like in the 290s before and it hurt. All right, 42, the answer of life and the universe and all questions involved. We now have two of them.
Wait, it cannot be put on the we Oh, that can't be put on the weapon, probably. Right. That makes sense. And physical protect. Start of the battle, reduce physical damage taken by 42%. That is so... It, it doesn't have a time limit, I think, right? This is just a flat 42% damage, uh, physical damage reduction for the entire fight. That is incredible. 30 seconds. Mm. Okay, if it's 30 seconds, then it has not as much utility as I was thinking. There's still some there, a good amount of it at least, actually, but... If it only lasts 30 seconds, then that's... We'll try it out. We'll science it and see what happens. Because right now, even one physical protect here, that is a lot of damage mitigation. We'll see how long it can go. How much does did the HP one give me? From 47 to 42. It is it's an infinite amount, but maybe the physical damage can help me offset it. We'll try it. We'll see, and we might notice it somewhere. Who knows? It acts as a buff. Alright, it's not a passive, it is a at the start of combat activate a buff. And if it's a buff, all buffs have a cold or have a time limit. That's how that is. Alright. In that case, it's it can still have a place. It can still have a place in certain fights that you plan on like not taking that long, but Yeah, it's, it's no first attack. That I don't want to use ever, but I want to say it still has a use. It still has a very defined, very defined place in what people would use it for, I think. A lot of fights don't last for a second. I'm pretty sure they won't. And that's like why I think a lot of cooldowns should be made shorter, because if a, cool, if a fight does last longer, you want those cooldowns. And I don't think I should be seeing cooled on that, say, 120 seconds. Both percent, I'll say sure. On you, we'll leave the physical protect, because the other one was just nighttime. It's a pity. It's a good one to have, admittedly, but... I'm gonna wait. Did I see a blue over there? I did. Two of them. 